So for starters, we have like a big uh, trailer sized door, a uh, sliding door that can be fully opened. And we are planning on purchasing a small uh, boat. Uh, and we also have this, uh, uh, this car that belongs to the company. So this will probably live here. And then this is the space. So this is about 250 square meters of, uh, uh, of uh, factory space. And that's about four times as much as we have right now. Um, the idea is to put a small pool over here where we're going to have do all the testing of the equipment. Uh, there's going to be some uh, warehouse shelving, different types of shelving over here in all this area. Uh, one part is going to have like a second floor so we can have additional shelving in the future. And then in this corner over here we're going to have like a, a, a lunch area. Uh, sofa, TV, you know, to have meetings, so just as a general uh, chill out coffee place. <clears throat> then here in the middle, we'll have the main production area, the main production uh, table. Uh, all the tools are gonna be trolleys, so the tools are gonna be inside trolleys, and we can move the tool sets around as we need them. The big machinery is going to be over here next to the windows so that it's easier for ventilation. Uh, CNC machine, laser cutter, uh, we have a Sintratec SLS machine coming in uh, hopefully this week maybe, maybe next week. Uh, <clears throat> we have some other machinery as well, some table saws and stuff that we're using. And then in the corner over here we'll probably set up like a small um, uh, research and development area that's not directly related to production. Um, then we have a small office. So this is not, the, the office space is not that much bigger than we already have, but uh, it's, it's, uh, it's a little bit more, um, uh, yeah, it, it, it makes a little bit more sense. It's, uh, the, 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 the current office space is sort of like L-shaped, which doesn't really work out that well because you have a lot of lost space. But here, so we'll have about probably like three islands with four uh, working desks on each island. And we can obviously, we can have a look at, we can look out at the uh, factory floor. And then we have a small patio. We're gonna put up a small kitchen here somewhere, over there, over here somewhere. Um, and we have this super cool feature. Um, this is uh, um, this is like a protected uh, piece of uh, architecture, um, so it can it you, we can nobody can touch it. Nobody can can do anything to it. Yeah, um, and it's pretty awesome. Well, look at that. So this is sort of like, uh, I don't know when this is from, last century maybe. Uh, there's a small pathway around the chimney. Uh, I think this factory, th this whole complex used to be one factory. Now it's many small factories uh, or warehouses, but it used to be a um, jam factory, I think. And then there's a feature here, and this is a bit weird. Okay, so we have one toilet uh, and another toilet. Ah. No idea what the people were thinking about, but uh, basically, so uh, we're gonna we're gonna change this out. So we're gonna take remove one of the toilets, remove this toilet, put in a shower here. So if people come uh, by bicycle or whatever, we're gonna have a shower before we get to work. Or if we are, um, if we are feel sweaty or dirty after the uh, after the job but before we want to go home or so whatever, you can do that also. So you know. It's just a comf comfortable feature. So, this is it. Um, last space we moved into, we moved into in November. And we thought that we were not going to need additional space for a long, long time. Now it's August and we've already outgrown it. So, um, we'll see. We'll see how long we'll stay here. The good thing about this place is that the owner of this whole uh, this this space is also the owner of the whole complex and i think there's several spaces next door here which are empty so uh, if we're lucky we can just occupy more space you know next door whatever <laughs>
So this is it. We're going to be painting the floor tomorrow. Uh, a li nice light grey colour that will make everything a little bit more bright. And uh, yeah, super.